Hey guys, today we are going to install the Ken, Kenco levels on the trailer. Uh, before you level the trailer, there's several ways that you can level it. One way is you just level it right off of one of the trim pieces or all with the length of it. You can do it from a window frame, whatever. The other way you can do it is right up here on the frame. So that, that way we can see it's straight. I don't know if you can see the bubble there, but it's straight. The other way is you can go on the frame that way and see that it's straight. Once you know that your trailer is 100% level, the next thing you want to do is go ahead and install these. And I'll show you how to do that. So these levels come with adhesive attached. If you wanted to, you can also permanently mount these by just drilling a small pilot hole, very shallow, and just screw them onto the unit. You do a hole, hole measure it out, put your holes, take a little bit of silicone, put it in each hole, and then you'll screw one in and then make sure it's perfectly level on that center piece and then screw your other hole. We're not going to do that today, but today we're just going to go ahead and use the adhesive on it. So what you want to do is you want to clean the area that you want to attach it very well. We've already test fit it behind there by placing the package behind. I know that the door will clear. So we're going to go ahead and peel the adhesive off. Then you're going to take sticking it on one side first trying to keep it as level as you can once you make contact slowly push it back making sure that you adjust for the level there it is now later on i can always take and pull it off and mount it permanently but for now that's going to do just fine i could even take a small drill drill it make sure i put the silicone in the hole and then put the screws in and then we'll do the same thing on the front as long as you have one of those magnetic catches like that, it clears just fine. Now on this one, I want to put it right in the center because when I back into the campsite, I would like to be able to look through the rearview mirror or through the rear facing camera and see where I'm at. Good enough. Okay, so we measured the center of the unit. It's going to be 40, 48 and a half. So knocked off the dirt right where it needs to go. Once again, we're going to find center. That's right there. We're going to take and make contact on one side, adjust, and then press in place. And once again, later on, I can always take and drill holes, put the silicone in, and mount it permanently. Anyway, that's how you install these. Hopefully that makes things a little bit easier for everybody to uh, level your unit when you get to your camping site. Have a great day. Take care and catch you in the next one.